Welcome back to our channel, folks. Today, we're diving deep into a topic that's puzzled us all at some point in our lives, hiccups. More specifically, we'll be discussing the only FDA-approved drug for hiccups. Before going into the topic, what are hiccups? Hiccups are those unexpected, sometimes annoying spasms of the diaphragm that lead to that unmistakable, hic, sound. But why do they happen? Your diaphragm, the muscle that separates your chest from your stomach, plays a crucial role in breathing. When it spasms, your vocal cords suddenly close, and voila, you hiccup. Hiccups aren't exclusive to adults. They can affect children and infants too. Now, let us see the types of hiccups. Hiccups aren't just one size fits all. There are different types based on their duration. Acute hiccups are the most common type of hiccups, and they typically last for less than 48 hours. They are often caused by minor irritations to the diaphragm, such as eating or drinking too quickly, swallowing air, or being excited or stressed. Acute hiccups usually go away on their own without treatment. Persistent hiccups are less common than acute hiccups, but they can be more difficult to treat. They are defined as hiccups that last for more than 48 hours. Intractable hiccups are the rarest and most difficult to treat type of hiccups. They are defined as hiccups that last for more than one month. If you have hiccups that last for more than two days, it is important to see a doctor to rule out any underlying medical conditions. Now, what causes these pesky hiccups? The list is quite extensive, but let's focus on the common culprits. Hiccups can be caused by eating or drinking too quickly, carbonated beverages, spicy food, alcohol, excitement or stress, smoking, and certain medications. Acute hiccups often stem from irritation of the upper gastrointestinal tract. But, they can also be triggered by chronic conditions or medications affecting gut nerves. Now, let's talk about chlorpromamazine, the star of today's show. It is the only FDA-approved drug for treating hiccups. Chlorpromamazine is a dimethylamine derivative of phenothiazine. It acts centrally by dopamine antagonism in the hypothalamus. Chlorpromamazine is a medication primarily used to treat conditions like schizophrenia and bipolar disorder. However, it has a surprising secondary use, treating hiccups. You might be wondering, how does this antipsychotic medication help with hiccups? Chlorpromamazine acts centrally by blocking dopamine receptors in the hypothalamus. This action helps calm the diaphragm muscle, which can stop those pesky hiccups in their tracks. Now, let us see the dosing instructions specifically for intractable hiccups. For tablets, the typical dosage is 25 to 50 mg orally, 3 to 4 times a day, for 2 to 3 days. If hiccups persist after 2 to 3 days of oral chlorpromamazine therapy, 25 to 50 mg can be given intramuscularly, IM. If hiccups persist after IM therapy, 25 to 50 mg of chlorpromamazine can be given as a slow intravenous, 4, infusion, in 500 to 1000 ml of normal saline, NS, while the patient lies flat in bed. Like any medication, chlorpromamazine can have side effects. Let's discuss what you should be aware of. These can include dizziness, drowsiness, and more severe effects, so it's crucial to use this medication under medical supervision. Remember, while chlorpromamazine can be effective for hiccups, it's vital to consult a healthcare professional if you're experiencing persistent or intractable hiccups. Look out for red flag symptoms like severe chest pain or difficulty swallowing. There you have it, folks. Chlorpromamazine, the FDA-approved solution for troublesome hiccups. This video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered medical advice. Consult a healthcare professional for any health concerns.